Today let us see a very interesting question from the topic factorial notation. Here question is prove that n factorial whole square is less than is equal to n to the power n into n factorial which is less than 2n whole factorial for all positive integers. Positive integers means natural numbers starting from 1 that is n is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on. Okay, These are known as positive integers. So let us start the solution. For any positive integer n, we can write 1 is less than equal to n. Suppose n is equal to 10. Suppose n is equal to 10. Then it is very easy to understand that 1 is can be written as 1 is less than or equal to 10. Here don't confuse with this inequality relation less than or equal to. Both the relations will not hold together, isn't it? Either it will be smaller or it will be equal. So it is okay. 1 is smaller than 10. Fine. So you can write here 1 is less than or equal to n. n may be any positive integer. Similarly, you can write 2 is less than equal to n, 3 is less than is equal to n, 4 is less than is equal to n, 5 is less than is equal to n, and so on. Up to suppose let us write n is less than equal to n. Here in this case, n will be equal to n. This is either smaller or equal to. So any one relation must hold here. So it is okay. n is equal to n. There is no problem. Now multiplying the corresponding sides. Multiplying left hand sides together and multiplying right hand sides together. Okay. So on multiplication, here we are getting this side 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 up to n. And this side n into n into n into how many times? n times. Because this is a first n, second n, third n, fourth n, fifth n, nth n. Okay, so n times. So this left hand side can be written as 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into n. This is nothing but n factorial, and this side is n to the power n. n has been multiplied here how many times? n times. So n to the power n. Let us call this as relation 1. Correct. Similarly, now we will consider we will take this part. Fine. So obviously, also obviously we can write n is smaller than n plus 1. For any value of n, n is always is smaller than n plus 1. Correct. Similarly, we can write here that n is less than is equal to n plus 2, n is less than is equal to n plus 3, n is less than is equal to n plus 4 and so on. And finally we will write here n is less than is equal to n plus n. n plus n means 2n. Here that is n is less than 2n. This is very obvious, very simple. Similarly we will multiply corresponding sides here. So this is n into n into n into n how many times this is first this is second this is third this is fourth so this is n so n times we are multiplying n how many times n times so left hand side will be n to the power n correct and right hand side this is n plus 1 into n plus 2 into n plus 3 up to how much 2n correct if you multiply both sides by n factorial here this side is n to the power n and multiplying with n factorial okay and it will become n factorial into n plus 1 into n plus 2 into up to 2n correct so therefore we are getting here n to the power n into n factorial this is less than or equal to how much this is 1 into 2 into 3 up to n. n factorials includes all the multiples from 1, 2, 3, 4 up to n. Up to when you proceed, this is up to 2n. So this is 2n whole factorial. Fine. Correct. Suppose this is relation number 2. Now we have to establish this relation. And here we are having n factorial whole square. So let us multiply both sides by n factorial here in this relation 1. So multiplying 
multiplying with n factorial. Here you will get n factorial into n factorial. This side is n factorial into n factorial. Okay. So this is n factorial whole square less than is equal to n to the power n into n factorial. Sorry, this is n factorial. Okay. So we are getting one important result here, another important result here. And by combining these two results, we will prove it. So therefore, by combining these two results, we are getting n factorial whole square less than is equal to n to the power n into n factorial and this is less than there will be only less than sign not equal to sign okay less than 2m whole factorial so now you can see we have come to this result here so this has been proved here very interesting, very simple, but very important question. You just go through it, try to understand and do practice at least one or two times. You will have a command over it. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much for watching this video. Wish you all the best.